This is not an excuse for China. It really will be hard pressed to buy as many goods as they've committed to in this trade agreement, because now even outside China forecasters are saying growth, which we take at the Chinese word as 6%, will be reduced to barely positive, maybe under 1%. Do you buy that? It would take a lot for it to drop down to 1%. I mean, probably if things don't go well, it's sort of in the 4 to 5% range. But people focus on the numbers of how many people died, and I understand why they do that. But in terms of the economic impact, just think about how many people can't go to work. And that could be devastating as well. And we think about China. But I never thought of what you said, though. Now, that those who do go back to work, who it could be compounding. Them. That's right. So if that's compounding the problem, people are not going to be allowed to go back to work. So the factories are shut down. Even if not a lot of lives are lost, okay. the economic devastation can be large. Professor, thank you very, very much.